Hello everyone. Today we are going to print multiplication tables. In this, if you want to print a table till 5, then the tables of 1, 2, 3, 4 will also print. So let's execute the code first. If you want to print the table till 5, write 5 here, then for executing the code, we'll press enter. And you can see here the code, the tables of 1, 2, 3 and 4 and then 5. The 5 tables are printed. So let's get back to the code. So for printing the table, we are declaring a function. For declaring a function in Python, we use a def keyword followed by the function name and then the parameter. So here I have written dev, then the name print underscore multiplication underscore table. And then I have passed a parameter here. Then I have taken a for loop for printing the tables in vertical format you can see here one two three so for i in range range is an inbuilt function in python which take three parameters first where to start from second where to stop and third one is the step will not require a step in this program so you can see here as i have started the table from one you can see here one and then here I have written 11. I have written 11 here because if you write, if you, I want to print a table till 10, you can see here till 10, then I have to write here 11 because the formula is, I have taken n parameter here. So the formula is n plus 1. So if I want to print the table till 8, then I'll write here 9. You can see here. And then inside the first loop we have taken as the second loop for printing the table in horizontal format so for this for j in range from we are printing from 1 and then n plus 1 if you want to print the table till you can see here as 5 so it will take this 5 here in the n 5 plus 1 it will be 6 and print the table till 5 and then we are printing the multiplication for that we are using the print function and inside the function we are multiplying the first loop with the second loop i into j comma and equal to black slash t backslash t here is using for giving the space between the elements and coming out from the loop we are printing we are taking print function as blank to give the space this is space we you can see here between the tables just like this is the one table and this is the second table then this is space between is used for this is given by this print then for taking input from the user we have declared a variable here mul and input and for converting that input into a teaser we have used the teacher function you can see here int inside the function we have given input and enter the number you want the table for now we have calling the function you can see here print underscore multiplication underscore table and passing the argument null here and if you will now run the code and if i want to print the table till 8 i'll write 8 here and then press enter and you can see I have made I have made the changes nine here so the table will print till eight on. So thank you and if you like the video you can subscribe the channel and like the video also. Thank you.